Hello, and welcome back to Not My Bag. I'm Joe, And I'm Lisa Bags. And... <laughs> <laughs> And today we have a very special episode because it's just mum and I hosting today, isn't it, mum? Yay! It is. Mum and son time. And yeah, how do you feel about that? Oh, it was my idea. It was her idea. Yeah, yeah, it was. Thank you. It was. You look very nice. Thank you very much. In my nice scarf that you bought me for Christmas or birthday? Christmas. Christmas. It's lovely. Did it's you have real, a fringe cut in? Shut up. No, I didn't mean that horribly. I haven't, Mum's been talking about her hair. I haven't had a fringe cut in. I've tried to do it differently. But um, yeah, it's just, it's not gone. It looked lovely on Saturday. It does look nice. Wash it today and it's just gone a bit funny. Yeah. Well, speaking of things going funny, um, I want to talk about January at the minute and January uglies. Oh, and it going on. Um, because yeah, I feel repulsive right now. I don't know what it, uh, it's going to no, start with a deprecation, like you say to me. Okay, right. I'll try and be positive. <laughs> I look like I have jaundice. Oh no, look at me last week when I didn't put any fake tan and I've tried that I know. facial and I look like a ghost. I just, I feel translucent. Is that the right, is that the right way? No, I think you look healthy at the moment. Do you think? Yeah, go and have one of them facials and it's a, like a chemical peel. I'm going to need something, mum, because I just feel a bit grotty. My greys are coming through again. You Salt and pepper. Do you to go to that place for your birthday? Vouchers for what? For uh, that what, place? What, Switzerland? No, the, <laughs> the place where I went to get all my stuff done. What, you nip and tap? No, Joe, the beauty place oh, around the corner. Oh, sorry, I thought you talked about your pussy. Oh, for God's sake. Uh, so January. Yes. How are you keeping to your resolutions? Um, I have started walking. Okay, that's When good. I get the opportunity to... To and from the off-licence or anywhere else? Uh, no, I just get that on the way home through the yeah. high street. <laughs> uh, no, I've been walking. Um, then I hurt my back, didn't I, last week, so that was quite bad. Mm. The <clears throat> lack of alcohol <clears throat> hasn't really lasted. Um, no. It never, it never does in but, January. But you know what? No, I know, but that's what I mean. So, and it's been so cold mm. that, you, you need know, to be warmed up from the insides. Yeah, well, um, <laughs> I don't none of know, that, none I of that. I don't want to know anything. But I'll tell you one thing the doctor did say to me, we're talk, like, talking about wine and stuff. She did mm. say that with my estrogen levels being so low, that red wine is really good. Okay. So the context, my, mum's on on the menopause, going through the menopause. Yeah, and, and my um, <clears throat> estrogen levels were really low. So mm. I Googled it and, and I did say to her, oh, it says red wine. She'd know that, that that's really good. Right. So It's worrying that. Yeah, I know. I know, but then I don't want grey teeth, so I probably won't have it. Yeah, I know. I find that. My teeth go a bit grey when I've ever, 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 um, ever had a bit of red. I was drinking sangria at the weekend. Oh, love a bit of sangria. Yeah. Oranges. Did you put orange in it? And No, just literally out of a carton with some lemonade. It's pretty much Ribena, but it was really nice. Sangria. I know, but yeah, no, it's January. so long since I've been in a brawl to even taste any, though. Well, you did go out with your girls in Malta in 20... Oh, God, yeah, and this take me four years to get over it. <laughs> I know, shitting on a pilot's feet's never easy, is it? <laughs> no, I'll sit on them, actually. Anything else going on this week? Uh, what's going on this week? Or last week? Last week. You just said you hurt your back. You've always got an ailment, haven't yeah, you? Yeah, hurt my back. <laughs> did a lot of walking I uh, had a lovely meeting with uh, my manager Ella which was lovely we, you know I said to dad I'd probably only be a couple of hours it's half past 12 I met her I'll come in at quarter to five cool to do. Cool <laughs> it was to great do. how's Dolly because I haven't been home in a week right well basically her little episode of her tummy flare up lasted nine days and so she's actually alright at mm. the minute okay yeah that's good yeah she's marching however, on however yeah. I have paid quite a lot of money towards mm -hmm. the bill and then her new lot of tablets and there's still £300 outstanding on her bill. Yeah. I know. Kind of hoping, I'm going to come to you and your brother with cap in hand and say, would you like to contribute? Cap in hand. Could you please? Cap in hand. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you like, are an Yeah, because that's nightmare. honestly, and, and when I went out to get her tablets on Friday, the woman went, oh, that's £93 for the tablets and, and she with, with the bill, so that'd be 300 I said, no, 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 no. I'm not paying the rest of this bill. And then you she did? Bought out when I got a chemical pill. No, no, that was next door. It's next door. Yeah, next door. yeah. So, I know. No, I, I know. Didn't. You no, need no. to quit Dad, while you're ahead. Dad bought me those vouchers for Christmas. So, okay. no, so yeah, so there is, but she's, she's good. Yeah. I mean, I've left her on, on her own today. So, Kane and I were thinking of walking her tomorrow morning, if that's all right. Oh, yeah. If you take her down the park. That's all right. To do wellies. that. Yeah, I've, I've got these boots. Well, listen, if it was just you on your own, I'd say no. But obviously, Kane's a lot more sensible than you. Yeah. Um, and he won't be on his phone and letting her eat fireworks and crusty Look, bits of bacon Look, off the floor. When you're running multiple businesses. The only thing is, I think it's going to rain. She might have to do a pavement walk. Oh, okay. Not Can't get muddy paws. She can, but you, you're going to get wet. No muddy nuns. Oh, no, not muddy nuns. Right, anyway. I've got some news trending topics right. to talk to you about. 
funny you have to Google them, Joe. Because like, no, I, d- I don't. I got sent these because yeah. I know that you might you get the Sun Online app, and it's just like reading a comic, and then you're kind of half in, and you know what's going on. I don't on. want to do that. Um, I don't watch the news, read the news. I know, which is odd because I'm obsessed with it and the weather. I don't. I know you love it. Whenever I'm home, the news you've got the blast in BBC News on your phone. You've got Sky News and BBC News no, notification app nice on. It's nice to know what's going on in the world. It is, but it's very depressing. Yeah, I agree. Some of the things and it's a little just, bit. It's, there's never happiness, and I think that just I'd rather not have that. Do you know what I mean? But it's what's going. If it's this morning talking about dance on ice and stuff, yeah, I like that. About Lorraine, love Lorraine. I've got a question about Lorraine. So I've got to tell you something about her in a minute. Yeah. Okay. What? <laughs> when Lorraine passes. Who will do Lorraine? Will, Christine, Christine Lampard. But will Lorraine stay named Lorraine? Yeah, of course it will. It will? Of course it will. Or, or will no, that slot that's be the, open? That's the brand, isn't it? Because I follow an account on Twitter that basically tells you, tallies at the end of the month, how many times Lorraine hosts her own show. She does have quite a bit of time off. A, a fair bit, yeah. Well, this morning she said that she's now doing... Um, because it's been 10 years since same-sex couples can get married. Right. They're asking if anyone wants to get married <coughs> on live on um, the Lorraine you show. You want Kane and I. She's going to officiate it because she's learning how to be a, like a, a mi- person A minister. Who, yeah. Is that right? So you want Kane and I to get married Come on Lorraine. Because I can go on there and all then. That's me in with the Lorraine show. This would be the worst proposal of how all time. How would that be? I was going to put you forward. <laughs> do, do it. I'd love to see what they came back with. So, number one on the news. It was circulating that David Attenborough might be dead slash in a hospital. Have you heard about this? No, that's fake. Fake, fake that's news. fake news. Lisa said fake news. That is fake news. We have the same birthday, David. Yeah, and I, I know. And I feel connected in a way. No, that, listen, So I I'm, think I would know in my whole heart of hearts. Would know. I think I'd know. Did you know he's the reason tennis balls are green? No, I didn't know that. So I don't know what years this was, but when there was black and white telly and everything... No, I don't know if this is right, so I don't want to misinform. But if it's black and white telly, you're not going to see... No, it wait, I think I'm, black, I, th- I don't want to misinform. There was a time period with tennis where the ball was black and white. No, it wasn't. I don't think it's ever been black or white. <sighs> I'm going to need Kane to fact check this, but let me explain it anyway. And then we can cut it if it's wrong. <sighs> Mum, there was a time when <laughs> the ball was black and white, like this, like this quarter zip that I'm wearing. Right. And then David said that on TV it couldn't be seen, so they changed it to green. And David Attenborough is the reason why we have green tennis balls. But you wouldn't see that if it was green on a black and white, so it must have been when no, colour No, it must tellies. have been when colour. I just when said colour... I don't want to misinform. So really? He, so he was the so reason. I'm, yeah, I'm not, I know, but the youth didn't say that right. Sorry. how would you know if green ball on a black and white telly? I don't I don't know. I think I made that bit up. I mean, my first television was black and white. Was it? I was I was 10, I think. Yeah. Was it? 10 or 11, yeah. Bloody hell. Not me sat with the dinosaur. Three channels. One, two, three, three channels. and that was it. Mum is really against streaming. She doesn't get it. No, I just don't. I don't know. She doesn't understand. She's like, there are I mean, our channels and our channels are our channels. what it is? My skybox is set up so that, like, if I say, like, call the midwife, yeah. um, then it will repeat it. when So it goes a whole year without coming on. Then when it comes on, I oh know it's going to automatically... So let me tell you about streaming. So you can watch that whenever you want. Oh, no, but, no, but you know what as well? Like, there's, there's things that... Um, I've been watching yeah. on my Skybox that I'd completely forgotten about and the Skybox has recorded them. Right. I've been watching myself on the telly. <laughs> if you've been watching Gogglebox repeats. So you can watch them on Netflix. Only because I just wanted to see what we all look like and I was like, oh my God. <sighs> well, I yeah, can tell you that bizarre. we've all changed quite a bit, haven't we? George looks oh completely my. different. Yeah, I mean, and like, I had a bit of a chiseled chin then. It was You could actually see me face. Oh no, don't, don't self-deprecate. Dan, just, you've never had a chiseled chin. Dan... <laughs> <laughs> Dad just sat there looking at Homer Simpson. Oh, outside. bless him. Dad didn't know where he was. But honestly, he keeps coming on. And he's the si- you know what it is? Because they're waiting for the new series. So they're putting all the right, repeats on. Okay, and yeah, I, was like, yeah. I was so bored the other day. And I thought, oh, waiting for Corey to come on. And it was just so funny to see. My favourite thing is when we used to sit there and watch ourselves back. And it would be us watching ourselves watch TV. And it was just felt like... I know, it's just mad. That it's like really very, mad. Very, very, very Really mad. But it's just like, it seems like such a long time ago. So, next one. It's saying there was a baby shower in the news this week where one man got five women pregnant at the same time. That's fake and all. <sighs> you can, he could have done that, realistically. But that's not news, is it? That's just pathetic. Okay. Well, I didn't, <laughs> I didn't make you the news. You want to some juicy gossip? Let's talk about Carl Walker, dirty little dog. Who's that? 
the footballer that's, that's got, he's already got a wife, he's got three kids, and he's now his mistress is really going backwards and forwards. He's got, he's going to have six kids altogether. I saw a big thread the other day because I didn't know much about Wayne Rooney, and my God, has he done some stuff as well, hasn't oh, he? God. Hasn't he done a lot? Yeah, but poor Colleen. I know, I don't know why. Yeah, exactly why. Did you have you seen some of those women? Oh, I'm not. No, we're not going to shame anyone. <laughs> <laughs> have you seen that someone got the saltburn grave scene tattooed on them lisa what do you think of saltburn so well, i only know what you've told me i think you actually need to watch no it. no i'll tell you what it is i told dad the other day yeah your generation think it's great all my people of my age group on facebook are saying what's a load of shit it's for, for at my age group it's rubbish but all you younger people think it's i think great. you could watch it it's not with Things in the bath and all that you told me about. But no. I'm sure you've watched a lot worse on like Downton Abbey and, and oh, things yeah, like that. Oh, yeah, Downton people do all that, don't they? Yeah. Well, no, but they do lift up a bit of ankle and show some, no. show some knee, I, just, some unshaved like, knee. There's quite a lot of things that you've put me onto and I started watching and I thought, God, this is so boring. Yeah, the, the most problematic thing I think you said recently is about Fool Me Once and you were like, I knew it was all going to no, happen. I know, I heard you. I, 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 well, I actually watched the, the podcast. It's not that. It's just that I um, I loved it when she told Gina Lumley to fuck off, Judith. And then she went, you can fuck off. I thought, oh my God. Yeah, I loved that bit. But um, yeah, there was a lot of it that um, I, I, could, I started to piece it together at the yeah. end. Yeah, I think there was some parts of it that were just like incomplete. Yeah, and I also thought being a mum myself... Where is your child when you're doing all this I, running I, around? I'm, we, I must agree. Yeah. Kane and I Where said is this your child? numerous times. Yeah, yeah. yeah you can't just go, oh, I'm going to get in the car also, and swap cars and go. I must say, she ragged that fucking Jaguar I know. dry. But ain't she beautiful? Into the, oh, she's stunning. I, know, I would, she is. Honestly, I, I would turn love for her. Michelle. She's beautiful. But every scene was her flooring it in that fucking Jag. She, what, what car does she drive normally then? Maybe she's doing an advert for Jag. <laughs> Probably. Right. Next topic of conversation, mother. Right. Love Island All-Stars. Right. But got me a new bottle. Stand here. Got it all ready in prep for the new series. Okay. Really excited to watch it. Yeah. Not really getting into it. If I'm you know. No, I just feel like they all know each other. They've probably all shagged each other on several nights out in whenever in like the past how many years it's been going. Yeah. And um yeah, it's just been, it's just grating on me a little bit. I think... Quite a few people have been saying that as well. Here's my hot take on it. I like the fact that they've all come out and done it, right? They've all got their brands. They've all like, you know, been out and done the club appearances, done all that stuff. They don't really have anything to get out of this. So they're not doing what oh, the... no publicity. No, oh. no. But what I mean is they're not going in there to like come out and do you know like so yeah, but joe it's getting their profile like that's what they're all doing no it. but what i'm trying to say is it seems a lot more authentic because they're not in there trying to like play a certain character not trying to cause drama or whatever aside mitch I they're just say. they're just in there to like kind of get i know i know what you mean get to know people but like the the georgia and toby thing the callum and molly thing it is really interesting that, that's what, callum, callum and molly, molly. i just oh, that's a bit odd and as well i'm sorry i'm sorry but i actually laughed when jake left what? Why did you I go know. in there? I know. Do you know who my favourite is? Who? Ever. What's her name? Hannah. No. Mum. No. I'm obsessed no, with I Hannah. No, I know. I thought you put that... Sh oh, no. She is absolutely phenomenal. She's bonkers, isn't she? Oh, I love her. She's going to be hilarious if she comes on here. Oh, she's coming on. <laughs> I'm paying that woman's flight directly from South Africa to this studio door. <coughs> oh, poke up, Chelsea. <coughs> God, I've got such a bad chest. I absolutely love Hannah. But Anton... Anton's so sweet. I know, but like him... He's such a sweet the, man. It's the breath spray. I know, but he's obviously just... He's obviously got a thing with breath, which is... Yeah, but you know, have, have, have some mints in your pocket. Like, I, I'm not Have mint you though. seen that man's gum disease? Who? What, Lewis's gum disease. But hasn't he got... He's got... So he's got veneers, and what's happened is the gum hasn't taken to the tooth, right? He hasn't got black all the way around. No, no, no. So the top search thing on TikTok under his name is Lewis Gum Disease, Love Island. I would simply leave the villa. Why are people so horrible? I know they are, but then I watched a dentist take on it and he said that when, when Demi kissed him, she must have just been able to taste metal because like that. She, she kissed him, I haven't seen that. Yeah, so Demi and Lewis have kissed. I'll catch you up. George What's going on with Chris? Chris had a kiss with Molly. They kind of chatted. Nothing's really happening. He's now on to Arabella, who's a new bombshell. No, I'm, she's beautiful, Arabella. Gorgeous. A little bit jarring, but gorgeous. Yeah. Um, and then, so we've got now Toby and Georgia have had a tiff. Oh. And then now no longer speaking. And Callum and Georgia are starting to explore a connection. 
And I'm talking about Georgia Steele and Callum Jones. No. Yeah. And because she's northern, she's pretty. No, babe. I know. Um, what do you think of that, Callum and Georgia? It's all for the bloody telly, Joe. It's not, it's not, there's nothing it's in it. It's all for the bloody me, telly. Let me tell you now. Lisa Woman said it's all world. a mirage. I know. Do you know what? I, I love it when the new season starts, but because I know them all, because mm. I've met a couple of them, it's yeah. just a bit like... But are you, so you're not really enjoying it as much. How no, would you feel? I didn't enjoy it, the uh, celebrity all-stars. I'm a celebrity all-stars. I just thought, right. no. How, no. how would you feel if Chloe Burrows went in? Oh, well, I'd be watching it every, every second. Every single second. Mm. Can you imagine that bombshell going in there? I do think she would completely tear it up in oh, a really good way. Oh, she just be hilarious? Yeah. Love, I just want her in. Let's get her in. Yeah, I really like Demi as well. I love Demi. None of those men, not one of them, I would look at and think, ooh, just not one. Would you not? No. He's not. Magic Callum's quite nice. But he's obviously far too young for me, but I'm just saying. I'm sure you'd try your luck if you had the chance. <laughs> no, no, no. A couple no, of no. bottles of rose do. Oh, well, yeah, maybe. Who do you think will win Love Island All Stars? <sighs> how many did he on for eight weeks? He's I been think on for how so. long has he been on for now? A week? A week, couple of weeks. Feels like a year. Do you know what I think? I think that Callum and Molly are going to have an arc, get back together and win it. Yeah, but see, a lot of people are saying that they, they split up just for the show, but I don't believe that. I don't know. It seems quite frosty. It doesn't mm. seem like they she did. She wanted marriage, didn't she? And he didn't want all that. I, d I That's genuinely his first don't know. Is it? Yeah, first girlfriend. Is it? it? I just love them together. I really do. She's very pretty, isn't she? She's gorgeous. Mm. If you could make your own cast, yeah, for Love Island All Stars, who'd you put in there? Chloe Burrows. Mm -hmm. Um. Oh God, Joe, you put me in the spotlight. There's so many people that oh, I've there loved. are. Um. Chloe. Who else? Probably Faye. Get Faye back in there. She was very, Faye. very controversial. Yeah. Shona. Shauna, okay. I think Shauna could, could do well in there. Um, she has got a baby now. <laughs> so has Hannah. Hannah's got a four-year-old. Hannah. Hannah's got a four-year-old. Hannah's got a four-year-old. Yeah, she's got a four-year-old little oh. baby. Oh. I know. I, was, I, thought you th I thought you were thinking of Hannah Holland then. I was really No. Yeah. I thought since when has the Queen no. of HLD um, had a child? I don't know. Like men-wise, who did I think... Apparently, Luca Bish got asked. To, uh, I saw times. that. And then oh, in the comments of the Love Island thing, he said, oh, I see you've got in because I declined. And it was under Mitch's announcement. Oh. I know. I don't know because there's been so many boys on there. I mean, yeah. you think who, I mean, you'd have to get some faces up and I'd go, cool, yeah, whatever. I think, yeah, it's, mm. <laughs> okay, fine. Well, I'll leave you to, um, um, what about Millie? No, but she's with Liam. Yeah, true. Yeah, she's with Liam, so that she wouldn't want to go back in. Yeah. Lovely Welsh boy. Be right. lovely, um. Well, I'll leave you to um, ferment in those. <laughs> You'd have those... to get the pictures up and I'd have to choose because it's so hard okay. having to think about There's it. There's a lot of cast members. I think when Maya said the statistics, when you look at how many people actually still together or are married and have kids out of the hundreds of people that have been in that cast. Sean Fudge. Sean she, Fudge. She was hilarious. Remember? Sean. Sean. Fudge. <laughs> she, was, she was funny. Was she? She was funny, yeah. I'll have to have it. I'll have to look her up. Um, next segment of the podcast, um, we were going to do a bit of a mother-in-law special today. Um, and you wanted him on, didn't you, <coughs> But mom? with the mother-in-law special, you have to have the son-in-law to be sitting here. So, so with. please welcome Kane. Hi, everyone. This is my boyfriend, Kane. Hi there. Um, you I might used have to be behind. It. Yeah. You, oh. Oh. The camera. <laughs> <laughs> This is getting us a really good start. Oh, Me, wow. Why are you looking at me like that? I think. It's like you want to do a, a grilling. No, no, I won't. I'm not going to grill. I, there are some questions because I don't know, even know how you do met. I feel like there's going to be a spotlight like that. I Ooh. know, I know. Dun, dun, You're dun, making dun, me dun, nervous. Dun, 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 mastermind. <laughs> um, how did we meet? We met first time at a, very briefly, at like a makeup event thing for Barbie. But yeah. then we properly met at um, Maddie Jepsen's birthday party. How long ago was that? Um, that was twenty third last year. Yeah. Oh. See, I know the date. Yeah, yeah. I got the date. Oh. Have you? No, I get overwhelmed. <laughs> um, uh, so yeah, we met then, and then um, we went to the box basically after Maddie's thing. But I was wearing shorts, so they won't, don't let you in when you're wearing shorts. So then I went home, and then um, I text Kane and was like, "You coming over? Would you like to come over?" And then well, you just met him. Uh, We'd twice and then um and then he diverted his taxi to mine so well, yeah i bet he did <laughs> <laughs> well you wanted to know how we met and that's how we met so we met. and so was it like instant what you, the, you yeah know? so basically this is actually a bit of inside information i got to his 
And I was like, we were chatting for ages and we we're just like talking about stuff for ages. And I said to him, I was like, I don't want to do anything because I want to go on a date with you, actually. Oh, I think this, so gentle, I was like, right? I was like, this feels like way more of a connection than like just to throw it away what and be like, oh, no, you agreed. Oh, I was going to say. Yeah. God, I'm not that much <laughs> of a monster. <laughs> no, we both kind of agreed. I was like, this feels like way nicer than yeah. just like a, gent? a throwaway yeah. situation. No? Yeah, yeah. Sorry, yeah. It's a bit of and I'm glad we did. Yeah, yeah I and I'm glad yeah. we did And then, too. so how long was it before you became boyfriend and boyfriend? When um, we, went we went to Santorini. <laughs> 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 we went to Santorini in the October, and then yeah. just decided from there. Really, no, but come on, let's tell the story about the Crocs. <laughs> she's mum's like receipts. Yeah, <laughs> proof, I, yeah. timelines. I thought it was so sweet. Though. Okay. And first of all, I didn't clock it. Yeah, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Crock it, did you? No, you didn't crock it. it. And then oh. I went. Oh my God. Okay. I mean, oh God, right, okay. Right. So <laughs> the way Kane proposed <laughs> to, be to be boyfriends. So the backstory is, is that we both have pairs of Crocs and he would always be like, your Crocs are crap because they've not got any of those. The what gibbets. They call oh, gibbets. I always I, call them giblets. I, I, yeah. I, yeah. I, giblets I, are in I, chickens. Yeah. So oh. mine haven't got any of the things in. So then he was like, it, they don't look good. They look awful. And I was like, okay, cool. So then for, to ask him to be my boyfriend, I filled every single oh. thing in He filled it. every single hole. Uh, so, <laughs> <laughs> With, will you be my boyfriend? And other things, like yeah. the Morty things that we... You had a really yeah. lovely time there, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. And then he we did... We adopted a dog and everything like yeah, that. Yeah, we Leah. did. Leah. I miss you, Leah. We met this dog that was not a stray, <laughs> but we thought was a stray. And I named her Leah, which is Greek for sunshine. <laughs> <laughs> no, Greek for greedy bitch. Yeah. Stop coming back to and your we, Greek for slut. Yeah, yeah. No. We bought her an entire chicken, like roasted chicken in a bag. She ate it all and just went back to a normal house. Yeah, no, I told you she wasn't the straight. I know. She was, I was healthy. Heartbroken. She was healthy. She was young. I she was, was a woman on the I street. I was combing mud out of her coat. I was like, we will oh give you a better God. life. We were, we were Googling and put on my story, like, how do we get a dog back from Greece? Like, can I drive it back in the summer? Like, I was going to air tag it. Yeah, uh, I was messaging charities. Yeah. I was going, how much do I need to donate in order to like fulfill, <laughs> fulfill the She was gorgeous. She was gorgeous. But I had a really nice time. Kane asked me out quite early on in the holidays. So then it was quite nice. I, I did it literally within like an hour of us getting there because I was like, I want it to be the holiday to enjoy it. Knowing that that... No. Then I would have... I don't know what I would have done. I mean, what would you have done if he'd have said it's I think, too soon? I think we'd There was a large cliff enough. out the back of the apartment. <laughs> <laughs> I would have... Yeah, see ya. Promptly had a run. Yeah. But no, I think we'd spoke about it enough that we kind of You've been single for such a long time, haven't you? Uh, for me, a long time, yeah. And I was I was just... Um, I think it was good for me, actually, because I feel like yeah. we met at a good time. Do I you know what I mean? I'd be single for a while. So you'd hop from one to another, have a yeah. nice, good few six... Well, you had six months off. Yeah, six I was longer than that. Yeah, it was actually. Yeah, and I, I did. Have, I, I, <laughs> I went travelling and found myself, didn't I? I went, <laughs> went on to a, I went on a few brand trips and found myself. Um, did. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway. So, um, so what are your intentions in the future for your relationship? What are your intentions, intentions. with my son? Yeah, I mean, um, do we see marriage? Do we see me buying a hat soon? We've actually, we've actually spoke about it a fair bit. Have you? Yeah, like, yeah, we have. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. I, I mean, mean what yeah. Do you think? I, don't know, I don't know how to word it. I'm <laughs> yeah. like, yeah, we've obviously spoken about it. So, so next it. step for you two, baby. Well, in the future, in the, in the future, like not the near future, but in the future, it would be like that first. And then I, I want to be like a young, hot dad. Yeah, would you want to get married before kids? Yes. Yeah, probably. Yeah. Yes. I have, oh, God. I have a traditional yes. mother yes. over here. Yes. Because yeah. <laughs> I wasn't. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My parents still aren't married. No! They're not married, yeah. They've been together since they were 17 and they're like 40. Funny, I have got a friend actually, right? she's been with her partner for 35 years and they're still not yeah. married. Yeah, my, my mum had My mum wants to, but I, I think they've just come to the agreement now that it's like, they're so far in, like, what's the point? A friend of mine last year, she just had a civil ceremony so that, oh, okay. I mean, it's quite depressing really because they've both got children with everybody else, like different people. Everybody so just, else. <laughs> yeah, so that if anything happens to one of them, that, that the, the children okay. on the other side of the family can't take... Do you know what uh, I mean? Okay. Yeah, I know what you mean. No child well, snatching. Are you going to renew your vows with dad? Oh, that's coming up. When is that? Uh, well, it's booked. <laughs> no, darling. It's not this year. It's next Do you next think you will? Oh. I, I would imagine that we will be 
dogless by then. So, oh, so no, God, Lisa, so we will again. Be able, we'll be able to go abroad and oh. like, do something abroad. So we thought you could all come and... Right, yeah, that would be nice. You didn't have to take the conversation with that awful I mean, the news. thing is, Dad keeps, Dad keeps saying about getting married in li the little chapel in St Ives, right? Right, that's very you. Yeah, but it only holds about five people. <laughs> well, yeah, with all due respect, Mum's only got about five mates left. Oh, so. shut your face, you. I've got, I've got more friends than you, have. <laughs> here we go. I've got uh, genuine friends. No, oh, oh, here we you go. Get you calling my friends snakes? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh, fucking hell. Um, I knew it would heat up after a That's cup of glass thing, of rosé. Who, who you um, sips, it's who you invite. It's like, do you invite yeah. the children? It's all like, we didn't. We got made in a restaurant office. We, I didn't want all that okay. drama. We all that said fuss. this because I would like to do it abroad like a very small intimate abroad wedding but you know when there's like older people obviously nan wouldn't get on a plane and yeah, it's and difficult isn't it i just really want my granddad there and I, he can't really get on a plane anymore. yeah but no what you could do is you could have a blessing over here yeah okay and then or, or the other way around you get married you have two outfits yes oh god a lot of people know a lot of people what they do is they get married abroad officially yeah. but then did you know that some countries you're not it's not legal in Britain. Get married oh, in Italy, it's not legal. Right. Um, that's where you wanted to get married. I did, in Italy, yeah. yeah but you, so that you have to come home and then get it um, done properly in the registered office. Otherwise, you're not legally married. Right. Right. Yes. Okay. Yes. I'll have to look at some other plans. Yes. Yeah. I mean, it is beautiful in Italy. So Italy's got my tick. Because I've never been. What? I've never been. Right. Either. We are going. We're going. Me and you. Go Put backpacking. the flies. <laughs> backpacking. Yeah, We'd be awful oh, backpacking. No, me. Can you imagine either of us trying to oh, do anything wrong? Oh, no, that'd be my rucksack. He's wine. <laughs> you would one of those bloody goon bags that come yeah. out of boxes. No. Get one of those camel packs that's got like a little... Oh, oh she there. went... That and a shiwi and she's down. I might, I think She'd be hiking the Himalayas. Jog, you know the, what the joggers have where you, they've got the wash in the Yeah, yeah. I might just get myself one of them. You need one. Yeah. I'll buy you one for the car later and I'll buy you a car seat too. Anyway, <laughs> any questions you want to ask Kane about like his job or any fun skills he has? He well, can lift his leg above his head. What did he say to me yeah, at Christmas? He's going to teach me how to sing. Okay. Yeah. He, yeah. Didn't, he didn't do a bad job singing Tom Jones. Insert clip here. Oh. Oh, God. <laughs> so funny. That was funny. So funny. Yeah, you did well. Ed said that I was that I got thrown over the back of the sofa and all my bits were hanging out. There was a point was in the a night point, oh, no. where you were thrown over the sofa and the pussy was out. Was yeah. It? Yeah. And it, it, until instantly came to me, he went, I don't want any videos of that going anywhere. So I was like, on patrol, like, everyone he, put your phones away. He was on pussy patrol. I was on pussy but patrol. Grace. I know. Yeah. If only Pussy Patrol sent it to Grace. Um, oh God. Well, wait, do you know what happened? Because we were all in our lovely outfits. And it and then changed Everyone so just went quickly. and said, when the chef went. I was hoping that what would happen, <coughs> this is for context at New Year's Eve, at our, you're right, Sorry. Sorry. Right, <coughs> at our family thing, was that I was hoping that everyone would stay till like midnight in their nice outfits. Obviously, I know that plan went to shit. And then we'd all get into our comfies. And all of a sudden, the moment that last crumb of chocolate tart hit everyone's lips, I went, get in our joggers. What, the one that hit your lips and was thrown up an hour later. <laughs> I understand, God, yes, that I didn't make it to midnight. But you were. But we've got next year. You were. Yeah, but do you know what? That's what I said, because everyone keeps saying to me, so what was it like? I went, do you know what? To be honest, it was like going on holiday with seven children. <laughs> it was. It was like... It was like the Von Trapp family. That's what it was it like. Was, it was a lot, wasn't it? Was it? Like it was a CBBC lot. version of Big so Brother. So long, farewell, I'll feed us in our jewel. It was a lot. <laughs> it was a lot. I and mean, then on New Year's Day, I got up, and then I thought, do I hoover? Do I? There was confetti everywhere. I yeah. mean, it took me... 20 minutes to hoover up me and dad and I looked at I went stop being at home I know but I had a fabulous time it was it was New Year's Day when we'd been away for two days and I've got videos of this of your mum on the sofa I just want to watch the bloody oh, news yes. no, no, that was... I want some normality I, we were like we've been I, away for 48 yes, hours Lisa and I went back to my room and watched Coronation Street didn't I and then I went to bed on New Year's Day at half eight I know you we all did yeah. wake up though the, on the second all feeling a bit... We weren't well. Yeah. Everyone was knackered. I mean, oh, no. I felt that day we went home, everyone was so tired. Yeah. It was, yeah. You can't, can't do that every single day. Got I was other, a shell. Got any other questions you want to ask? No plans for the future with your work? Any shows or anything or... With work... He's a musical theatre boy. I do do musical theatre. Um, you can get your leg out of the mine, can't you? <laughs> it's hard at my age. Oh, oh, God, I don't want to know where your leg's going. <laughs> <laughs> Hasn't been anywhere for a while, love. <laughs> I just got offered a show in London, mm -hmm. but things didn't work out from my side of things in oh, terms right. of like the, the negotiating right, stuff okay. um, on my side. And I just thought, 
I've been working so full on, which I'm very lucky yeah, to Yeah, you have though, you have. So full on for so many years now from graduating <gasps> from 2019. Doesn't seem like a long time, but it feels like a long Ooh. time. Um, That's five years. Yeah, it's which a, is and the, but to be fair, time. there's COVID in that a little yeah, bit. Of COVID, yeah, but yeah. yeah, it's just been a lot. Smidge, smidge, smidge of the old sea, smidge of the old sea. <laughs> but yeah, it's um, it's been a lot, and the schedules that we do for oh, my I know. work. Oh, well, I know. I mean, like you what you did with the pantomime. I mean, oh, it's just it's, I don't know how you did it. I it's a lot. He left on New Year's Eve. And then came back. Wait, no, you left now, on New Year's Eve morning. He, what was the night when he was sitting there and you was all in the hot tub and he was going, I've got to be Peter Pan in five hours. <laughs> I was like, I need to go to bed. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to have a bit of a break for a little bit. We're going to do some more things with you guys. Aww. Do some things with you the family. Do some things with Joe? Yeah, me and Joe have got a few things that we're like having a look at at the minute. So yeah, we'll see. Oh, I'm going to take a bit of a break, I think, for a little bit, and just modelling. Pair of you, George Michael, Andrew Richley. Yes, we could just be a wham tribute, tribute act. act. Yeah, tribute I need not. singing lessons, but we yeah. could do it. No, you know, like when, when what was the remember the Lucky Darky agencies where you used to go around and turn up at people's parties and pretend to be. Do you remember that? Yeah, I think our target audience will be about 50, 60, but that's fine. The more, <laughs> honestly, the more cataracts, the better. We'll just look. Better. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. We'll look more like them. Every honestly, day. You know, yeah. turn, I remember this to be a look like David Jason, David Beckham. Who's bear. David Jason? Who's David Jason? What? What? Only falls and horses. Yeah, people used to make money out of looking like them. Did they? There was Adele lookalikes. When there was a Kate out. Moss lookalike recently um, who held an Audi bag or whatever and it went viral and did yeah, so yeah, good yeah. for marketing. It was just lookalike. Really? Banging. Really funny. Yeah, yeah. We're now about to play a game called Monster in Law where Kane and Lisa ask each other questions. Why did I just say Kane and Lisa? Like, that was so weird, wasn't it? To call you Lisa. Oh, yeah. yeah. Kane and Mum. Kane and Mum ask each other questions mm. to find out who knows each other best. Oh, <sighs> Right, come on then. Right, fucking come on then. <laughs> come on, you and uh, the if you up. get them right, you get to have a shot. Oh no! Or shots at the end for the winner. You get to have a shot. Oh. I, yeah. I just, I can't lie. I just added that rule in. Um, <laughs> let's just do the questions. Then whoever wins gets a shot at the end. Yeah. Oh. Or I've got loads of mints. You could have a mint. Or a mint, but I know which one you'd prefer. My flumps. Are, I've had to throw my flumps out because they've been hard in my bag. Mum carries flumps, flumps in her bag. All I time. love flumps. I love flumps. Do you remember? Do you, you're too young to remember the TV show. What TV show? Oh, you need to get them up the flop. <laughs> you need to see what a flump looks like. What, it's not, is it marshmallow? No, it's oh, you, listen, you've got to get it up on screen what the flumps used to look like. The flump. The you got to, you've got to. And then get the theme tune on. Go on YouTube, it'll be on there. The flumps. The flump. The flumps theme tune. And get the get characters up. Let me speak, hear them. Grandfather Flump was playing a quiet after breakfast tune on his flumpet. What? what is this? That music's too loud. Much too loud. <laughs> this feels like what it's like when I go and visit your family. Oh, stop it. No, look, listen, you listen to some of them talk. They're just so adorable. Ew, this water's cold. I'm not going to watch in this. No, I'm not. <laughs> this is the most funny, honestly. When was this? When was this out? It was in the seventies. Honestly, oh, the seventies was a fever dream. Oh, oh yeah. You honest... got walking coconuts and beanies on. From up north. <laughs> I think they look like jacket potatoes, didn't they? Oh, they do. Oh. Yeah, they do a little bit. I right. Jacket potato for the other day for the first time in ages. They're so good. Oh, Jack, it's with cheese and beans. Yeah, that's what I had. No butter, oh. but the beans on first, cheese on top. Yes. A bit of black pepper. Oh, yes. Okay. Get me. I'll put a bit of chilli well, on as well. Well, that's tomorrow night for your dinner. Yeah, I will. <laughs> I get on like a house on fire, as oh, you can tell. I was going to say, I'm going to do a chilli tomorrow night. Oh, oh no. no. I don't like chilli. Oh, oh, right. My belly, my belly can't. Did you get your bolognese? He'll be shitting like the no. start of um, Shanghai think, by the I'm just thinking of a one pot dinner. Okay. Can't one do, pot dinner. Can't, can't do chi chicken casserole. No. I love chicken casserole. He hates it. What about dad's sausage and bean? Oh, casserole. Oh. I love that. No, but dad's not going to be there. I've got to do it myself. Oh, okay. I have to be a after a couple of old bottles of shakshi. Why don't we just get a takeaway? Kane, really? Kane, that? that's all we do, babe. I love it. That's all oh, we do. do. I love it. meal, but... Why don't you do like a beef bourguignon? A be what? No, because... A beef what? Bourguignon. I'm not sure that's it. It is. That is actually a beef bourguignon. <laughs> is it? Yeah, beef bourguignon. I don't know how to say it because I don't Co want to say it. Cocker van? Yeah, we, we, you had one of them. Um, no, we're not having them. <laughs> oh, come, come on. We need to discuss tomorrow night. Then I was going to do a chilli. Guys, honestly, this is I what poo. it's like every You'll single poo. time. Oh, my belly I don't. Bad. I can't have a chilli, I'm afraid. <laughs> Spag, I'm spag bowl he doesn't really like. Right. I don't mind a spag bowl if it's got cheese on. 
she you won't like hers no offense that's mean no 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 i love that's my, mean i love mum but it's very lumpy of vegetables and i know what you're because like i put a lot of veggie like mushrooms loads of peppers onions oh. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, no. Should we get on to the game and <laughs> then discuss the dinner in the car? Sorry, yeah, okay, sorry. Question number one. For who? <laughs> sorry, for Kane. Okay. Right. If Lisa could have a show based on her life, what would it be called? <laughs> Come on. Um, but you, you don't have to be kind either, I can take it. I don't know. I'd say loose women. Oh, yeah. No. Loose woman. Loose woman. Not that in way. every sense. Yeah, but I wasn't like No, oh, I didn't. No, you weren't loose back in the day and your surgeon obviously tightened you up, so probably... <laughs> probably not. Um, Maybe tight woman. Tight... Wonder woman. Wonder woman. Right, okay. Question for mum. Right. What's the most unusual or surprising talent that Kane has? Getting his leg above his head. I mean, who knew? Can you do it in jeans? <clears throat> no. I don't know. No, don't. You, no, you might rip your testicle. No, no these tra jeans. trust me, mum. Oh, my God. He gets his... He oh, you all right? Look at, I'm sorry. He's ambidextrous. <laughs> That's when you can write with both hands. Yeah, and you can do it with both legs as well. <laughs> oh my God, you. Oh my God, oh my God. He's ambidextrous. <laughs> um, Kane, <laughs> what is Lisa's secret talent? Oh, that she knows every word to Tom Jones. It's not unusual and puts on a full four act performance and, and Barry Manilow her oh. name was Lola <laughs> yeah. she was why didn't you do your girl. Tom Jones reenactment no just quickly it was when you went below the yeah, kitchen no, no, island no, do you know what when, just, when, when just, I went just a little with, one when I went with dad to see him there were people <laughs> videoing me because I actually was having an out of body experience just grab the mic and just do a tiny rendition it's not unusual to be loved by anyone <laughs> there you go She's a show woman. Yeah, show, her name was Lola. <laughs> she was a show girl. We yellow feathers in her hair and a dress like down there. I think when we do tour the podcast, I think that that should be the song that you walk on to. Oh, and I'm gonna yeah. tell you what, I'm coming yeah. on full regalia. Yeah, uh, well, full it's a show girl. Oh, yeah. Imagine that with the, the big with feathers, feathers. Yeah. the Las Vegas. Her name was Lola. I yeah. think we need a full entrance for you being carted in, entrance. maybe by carted. a topless man. A what? Painted in gold. Maybe Kane oh, can carry that on. My job. Dad coming on as Homer Simpson. Oh. Let's not. He's a lovely man. No, he is. Um, I think, yeah, I think that should be your entrance. Um, me and Tal can carry you on. You, you wouldn't be able to lift me. <laughs> um, Lisa, what's the weirdest family tradition you had to teach Kane? Um, drink. Just drink and be merry. <laughs> yeah, because my family don't really yeah, drink. drink. Yeah. And also, as you know, I'm very open about talking about yeah. stuff. Yeah, yeah. So that's one thing I know you've got to get used to, but it's just the way yeah. that we are. No, we're extremely yeah, very open family. Open. There's there like, is nothing off limit. There is. There really nothing. isn't. Like when you enter yeah. the house. I mean, yeah. I feel like which is very different to how I how my family is. Yeah, but yeah. you've got a lovely little younger brother, so it's a little bit. Yeah, different. he's very yeah. different. And also, I'm very open with my parents anyway. Yeah, yeah but you, not you're, to. Yeah. you're like extra open. No, I'm we're extra, babe. <laughs> we're like, yeah, but I feel like you're more like emotionally open, whereas we're just like, oh, like, oh, yeah, my I just blew my up family. the toilet. People just say it as it is in our house. Yeah, because we also there's no young kids in in our family at all, like in our direct family. So we gave up the whole swearing thing years ago, didn't we? So then yeah. when I met Kane's brother, I was like, no swearing. And the other day he no, was on I'll, Face. I keep getting told off. Mum, Kane was on FaceTime to his dad in the kitchen and I walk in after a call and I didn't know that his dad was at his nan, like his nan's. Yeah. So like I walk in and I'm like that <laughs> fucking bad. And, and I was then like, I saw Kane's oh the whites God, of his eyes. Ever, and, and then I was like, oh, hi. Like, oh well, my should, God. Be, should be watching this, so say hi. <laughs> I mean, can We've you just been talking about my mum's tight snatch My, for my nan minutes. washes everything. Okay. She'll be, she'll oh be God, here. Can you imagine, Dad, if you met your dad? Oh, my God. Oh, we'd have to put tape over gaffer tape. I don't think you would. I, no. don't, I think they're very similar. I, I, think, uh, I, think, I think they're very similar. Tell them my dad, Glenn, would get I on very, very I think very Dad well. would just have to ply a couple of pints. But Dad is very... Like, our Dad is very like... Um, not our dad. <laughs> <laughs> my dad. My dad's also very malleable. Like, he'll take to any social situation. Oh, yeah, it'll I mean, be great. I think Dad's a social butterfly once had a drink. Yes, really? he wants yeah. Terry as a couple of drinks and he relaxes. I'm a little bit yeah. like that, but I know you might think different, but I then will stop, whereas Terry Dad will carry it. on. Dad's I like mean, a snowball. Like, yeah, oh, okay. I mean, he just will just continue just and continue. I mean, continue, the last continue, two mornings continue. he's got up at half past nine and... 20 pounds. He's like a teenage boy. He's like reverted back. Like, oh, after, let his him birthday, live. after his birthday, didn't he throw up all over himself? And... I've had to buy him a new rug. 
<laughs> oh. Yeah. Oh. Did you not hear about that? No. What he did? No, so I bought, I went into Tesco's the other day. Rug should have been 50, 60 quid, whatever. Okay. It's half price. Bought it for my room. Wrong colour. Bought it for Dad's. Terry, on the night of his party, came home. I hadn't even walked up the stairs. He's the door shut in his bedroom. Yeah. Um, and I thought, right, okay. In the morning, I said to George, I'm actually quite concerned about your father because I don't think he's breathing. This was quarter to 11. She does this every time someone doesn't wake up past Yeah, but well, I, I used to go and check he was breathing all the time. So I'd, I'd have a lay in, I'd have her in the Some room looming over me. To be fair, on New Year's me. Eve, I was checking with he was all right. I've just got to think about sudden death hours. syndrome. I really have. So anyway, so God. day after Terry's like birthday, so anyway, quarter to 11, he's come down and he looked like. He just walked out of the ocean. I said, he was, he was like Not like Jason Momoa, though. Oh, I wish it was, God. Um, yeah, I mean, stick a wig on him, I might have done. He <laughs> came out, he, was, he had sick all over his jumper, all over his jogging bottoms. But you know, you only turned 60 once. Yeah, so. but, and he went, I oh, don't fuck him. I don't remember nothing. I've got the video. Don't remember she nothing and all him. that. You filmed, filmed him. She filmed him entering the kitchen in a dazed, confused, sick state and was going to post it on TikTok. Yeah, but hold on a minute. So is said, it funny though? So, no. no. It's hilarious. Oh. It is. So I said, I'm going to name and shame him. So I said, to him, I've never done that in 31 years. So I said, are you okay? And he went, yeah. So anyway. The, uh, so I've I've got I've got George and Lauren around. So I've doing a full roast dinner. Okay. Walked the dog, cleaned all the toilets, bathroom, done all that. What I do, go oh, go to Tesco. If it's come, one thing Lisa will do, it's clean those toilets. Yes, yeah, told you, clean toilets in Britain. So then I've come <laughs> back from Tesco's and um, I'm doing the dinner, and all of a sudden, bearing him on ironing as well, he's gone like this. I went, what do you think you're doing? He went, ah, oh, well, it's fucking kid, I'll kill her in this house, and I went. You are you are. If joking. there's one thing that my mum and dad say constantly, it's kill, kill or kill. kill, and it's and only you know what? Sometimes it does strike. What does some, that mean? That means, means that if you you're still a little bit, it will bit, kill you off, or it will kill you, or you feel going. better. And it, usually for me, it for makes me feel a lot better. <laughs> so anyway, so he's, listen, he's carrying on drinking. So there I was. I thought, right, potatoes have got cut. I'm just going to go upstairs. I'm going to now make his bed. <clears throat> His bed was covered in sick. What, and he'd left it? And he'd sit on his rug. He didn't realise, probably. Oh, he didn't realise. He, he must have gone like That's this. Fine, he he must have gone oh, like yeah, this. yeah, he is. Got up, and then if you saw his back, he fell into his chest of drawers, cut all his back. So I said, that oh. rug is going out. But, he, but then he carried You can't on, get it out of a rug. Carried on drinking all day. And then at six o'clock, I mean, this is not going to look very nice, but I'm just going to show, emulate what he did. He was like this. <laughs> on, the, on the sofa... I mean, I'll do that again. <laughs> so I've got an embracing Terry. Let the man no, breathe. Terry, Terry. And I couldn't wait. So in the end, I took his socks off. I'm slapping him around the face. I thought he's dead. He's passed away. He's dead. Did you he's check dead. his pulse? Well, I didn't thought, no, well, he's gone now. So let's get his policy out. <laughs> you get the paperwork out. <laughs> and then I went to him. I went out of bath. I come downstairs. It was eight o'clock. And I went, right, now get yourself upstairs because I've had enough of this. Oh. I said, no, it's your birthday, but it's just absolutely disgusting. May we finish I'm the game? I'm so hard not to laugh. May, may, we, may we finish the game? <laughs> I was trying so hard not to laugh. I'm going to, you <laughs> bastard. <laughs> can, we, can we finish? We've got yeah, three sorry, more questions. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah, anyway. Get sorry. carried away. Um, Kane, what is the oddest piece of advice Lisa's given you about relationships? About relationship. Oh my god! When you said to Joe the other day on the phone, he told me he was like, "It was like Kane's a good one. Just enjoy it whilst it lasts." Did I say that? Yeah, like, like, was uh, I pissed? Yeah, probably. Oh, there you go. This so is just why are you taking any notes of that. <laughs> it's just funny. No, but I oh, know, but as well, no, I don't mean no, like no, it was, with no, you it wasn't, two. wasn't whilst it lasts. It was like hold on to him while you can or something. Yeah, like that. Yeah. and I was like, oh, that's really no, nice. No, but Thanks, I'm not being Lisa. funny, but like, it's all you're in this love bubble at the moment. It doesn't last. Oh, when yeah. you have kids, it doesn't last. I know, but you can still make it work, like you and Dad have for thirty years. Oh, fucking hell! I need, I need some compensation to be honest. Anyway, oh, I'm that life insurance might come in. I'm, try the I'm trying to stay positive. Um, the one piece of advice that I fucking take away from you constantly, mum, is don't you dare look at my snatch. Oh, yeah. Which you, you said which you said on the operating table to your surgeon. Oh, yeah. no, 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 no. Yeah, oh, yeah, there is a story behind that. I mean, I'm not being funny. It always he is. Did, he did do my boobs and he's done my tummy tuck. And then when I went to have my second... Well, I went, I went to get them made smaller. HRT's yeah. had another, anyway, so they covered up. So as he's gone, well, not, as he's holding my hand, I said to him, right, just make them as small as possible. I went on one more thing. He went, well, I went, do not look at my nunny. Like, no, you, no, let's say what you say actually said. Say the quote. Said. What did I say? Don't you dare look at my fucking snatch. Yeah. So anyway, when I woke <laughs> up, 
But you know what the funny thing was? The anaesthetist was trying to get the, the you know, to knock yeah. me out in my yeah. vein. I was making him laugh so much. He went, right, can we just stop? He said, because, <laughs> he said otherwise, I'm going to give you a dose. You're never going to wake up. I went, Ooh, actually quite Don't say that to me. We're oh, yeah. about to get knocked so, out. Um, cause, because he was talking about skin. And I was sort of like, because they give you like a pre medicine a bit yeah, yeah. And I went, you know what's going to happen to me? I'll get right up to the top of that mountain and I'm going to want to have a piss. So he went, <gasps> so then, then Carver come in, he went to me, yeah, okay, Alicia, I went, yeah, I went to me, I went to him, do not look at my surgeon. And then when he came in and woke me up and he went, you all right? I said, yeah. And he went, I did have a little look. No, he didn't. Because he did the operation. He said, your scar is, he said, your scar, not me snatch, your scar is amazing. And he said, and considering, oh. considering <laughs> okay. it's been 15 years, he went, you look amazing. I went, oh. That's... I don't think that's weird. I, don't I don't know, know if it's I think that I might be the only other man in 31 years that see my snatch cane. If he thinks it's all right, that's good for me, babe. I'm happy for you. Do you not think that's a breach no. of like, ethical no. conduct? No, because I said to him, no, no, to be fair, I did say to him, could you just check it's all right? Okay. I did sort of check all as well. Just check everything's as it should be. Yeah, yeah. If it's not, give it a little shave. May I say, Lisa, a you have shave. a mighty fight. Give the lad a little shave. <laughs> Next question for Lisa. <laughs> What's your favourite memory from when Joe was growing up that you haven't shared yet? Oh. Oh, there isn't one she didn't sleep, Joe. <laughs> favourite memory? <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. See, why didn't you prep me for this? Because it's probably loads of Oh, you couldn't think of just one nice thing off the top of your head, no? But there's been so many. I'll, I'll name a couple. Um, when I saved up all my money on a residential trip to buy a puppet. <laughs> what? When I went on my residential trip to Norfolk, saved yeah. up all my allowance at the end of the week to buy a puppet from Colchester Zoo. Oh. Mum embraced me so hard for missing me for the week that she cracked the puppet in half. Oh, Never got reimbursed. No, or, but that's, it's not on purpose. Or how about... I was, I'd missed him so much and George was only tiny. Come off the couch. And I went, Joe, and all you heard was... You're like, all like bending well, like about... and more. I went, he went, oh, you've broke my puppet. My I went, puppet. I'm so sorry. What else did you do? Um, <coughs> what else is a nice memory about me? It's been so many. Say one then. Yeah. <laughs> no, when you when you used to buy me something like you like you'd make dad go up the high street because you know he never used to buy me anything. And you'd Christmas Day, like they were like like, you know, I mean they weren't worth very much. These presents Terry was too tight, but Joe wanted to buy them for me. Okay. And that, and also Joe used to make me make me handwritten cards. Oh, I used to do I that. I love parents, that. Yeah. I love that more than a for me, that means a lot yeah. more than I got all your George Michael memorabilia in a frame one year. Yeah, that made me cry. Actually. That was out. a lovely present. That's a really good present. Oh, yeah. that's, that's probably half of the tickets I had, um, but I couldn't find all the rest. They're probably in the garage. Okay. You could do that whilst we're back. Uh, next question. Yeah, uh, Kane, uh, uh, it says, what was it like over New Year's being under one roof for a few days? Oh, I think oh. we know the answer to that. Yeah, it was It was mental, but I I don't know. Like I, I feel like I... It just feels normal because I, oh, I feel like wait, that's although it's the, that's been fairly question. recent, I still feel like I just read the wrong question. What, what do you mean? Sorry, that was a completely different segment. That was the okay. segment before. But anyway, oh. <laughs> yeah, I just feel like I just feel like it's normal. Like I'm so I think because I've spent so much time with you that I just I just did, I did it's just it was lovely on TikTok like when you post that Vinny was going I love your relationship with Leisha and I said he's just like part, part fam yeah it just he's feels like, normal to yeah. me now when you was like, when you was car wash in my ear and I'm going <laughs> don't want to listen don't. and he nicked my vape I thought well, you're dead, <laughs> you're dead tomorrow um, Lisa what is the most embarrassing childhood story about your Joe that you haven't told Kane yet um, does he know about the nappy situation yeah he knows I haven't pooped for 12 days god that Awful. God. Oh no, um, yeah. Well, okay. When we took uh, you to Adam Brooks oh, and you no. <laughs> What's we, Adam Brooks? We, it's a hospital. hospital. Okay. And what did we take? We asked, I didn't sleep. Because he was having he was a sleepwalker like really badly. Yeah. He actually opened up the front door. Um oh, he was terrible. Um he actually threw a quilt over George's head one night and was I picked up my it. entire mattress and walked around yeah, the landing. Right. And then, so we had to take him because we thought there's something seriously not right here. Yeah. And um, the doctor And you were right. Him, yeah. <laughs> the doctor said to him, can you hop up and down? So he's like this. For context, so for context, for context, I got, I get really nervous, right? Because I, I used to have a really big fear of needles. So if okay. I went to a hospital environment, I would start like my stomach would go funny. That's changed, hasn't it? Like, what do you mean? With your Botox. Oh, uh, well, I haven't had it in a while. So, so he was hopping up and down on one leg and he was farting the whole way through. And me, me, <laughs> me, George and Terry going... Hopping, but where my stomach had turned because I was so scared of it. It's not because you're just jumping up and down. I used to no, do but my, I was so scared of what was going to happen. I had a lot of trap wins. So every bounce, she asked me to hop one leg and I was going... Poof, poof, 
And then um, they were all laughing at me about it. Yeah, that was funny. That was hilarious. And, and we're all like this, trying to pretend that he's not doing it for It was, oh it was mortifying. Did you see the guest of art video? Yes. How awful. I actually... Uh, do you want to hear, hear the second one? We've got part two. It sounded like it didn't come from him. Do you want a part two? Wait. Part two, Roman Reloaded, the re-up. How can Guess you... the part. Now this is my part. guessing. <laughs> oh, that's Honestly, even worse than I remember. I truly do not know what was going on with my ass. You know when you start it and you're like, it's so that long. That like a machine gun. Just call you me Machine well. Gun Kelly. Um, so, I'm sorry, next question. Oh, God, honestly. I've, I'm, I'm, we're rolling for them. Um, Kane, if Lisa were to write a self-help book, what do you think the title would be? Um, it's got to be something to do with wine, hasn't it? Yeah. It's got to be how to drink as much wine <laughs> as humanly or inhumanly possible. Oh, God. I think. Mm, what could we do oh Kill or Cure by Lisa Vag Kill or Cure Kill or Cure Kill or Cure by Lisa Vag's yeah. hitting the shelves in autumn this year I think that could be a New I York mean, Times bestseller I've never seen anyone so surprised as Grace when I went into her on New Year's Day and it was 12 o'clock and I went to Grace do you want a glass of, glass of champagne she, she went like this she was doing her makeup and she did like a 360 she went what now <laughs> yeah. I went yeah and I'll tell you what she went do you know what she said get me a Barocca and get me that glass of wine. And she did. And she did, and she did you know with the what? cheese board in she hand. She did really well. Yeah, and she did really well. I think she was traumatised after coming away with us, but hey-ho. I think she loved it. Yeah. We, we are family now. We need, a, we need a telly show, Surviving the Bags. Surviving, surviving the, the bags. bags, like Bear Grylls. <laughs> yeah. Surviving the Bags. Yeah. Truly. God. If Lisa could have any superpower for just one day, what do you think she'd choose and why? Um, to have an immortal liver. Like a like an iron liver. liver. Yeah, I was just going to say because you I've had your blood test back, didn't you? And I've it was had fine. two in two months, and there's nothing wrong with my liver. Everything else is fat, but my liver's all right. <laughs> <laughs> you are a medical mystery, I don't and we love know, it because I do look after myself. I know you don't think I you do. do. No, you do. Are you registered as an organ donor? Because someone no, could, do you know what? Someone could do, have that liver, and then I mean, be great. I've got, I'm blind as a bat. I mean, am well, I, they're not spoon out your eyes. Just take the good bits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, could have me implants. Yeah, yeah, I know. They'd have to take these out because these don't burn. Oh, they don't oh burn. God. Burn, baby, burn. Well, don't worry, I'll it's hang them up. Is that what you want? I'll hang them up in my house. I'll yeah, frame I'll them. You're hanging baby. them up? Yeah, I'll have mum's implants in a jar. No, they have to take them out, don't they? Yeah, no, yeah but I'll, he wants I'll, them in I'll a jar in the them. house. They no. Be enough, so you might as well. We need some art. Get some use. We do need yeah. some art. Yeah, you can have one. I'm not going to die yet, though. No, I don't. No. Sorry. You're Miss Morbid. Anyway, lastly, Jesus. lastly, to end the podcast. Uh, we do this thing called Cancelled Courtroom every week. Mm. We will be taking it in season two, coming very soon. Can I just pour out some wine before we do this? Yep, sure. I'll explain this to the audience. <laughs> um, as you know, weekly, we say a problem that's happened in the bag's house. Oh, someone, will be getting, yes, someone will be getting cancelled that week. It could be dad for farting or drinking. It could be George <laughs> for not even turning up. Mum, has anything happened this week? So I haven't actually been at the house last yeah, week. Yeah, and this, this is the council courtroom for me. Okay. You've not been home oh. and our garage still looks like a shit bit. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I chucked out 14 bags. Didn't chuck out. I placed 14 bags of clothes in the garage. You know your father. Because I'll be donating them. And, your um, father had to go to the tip yesterday with a blown up foam costume next to him. No. Yes. In the passenger seat that he took to the tip. No, he shouldn't have done that. Joe, I need... I'll show Kane later on. I could have taken them for Kane's <clears throat> brother. What are they? You wouldn't get them all in your car. Domino's dip costume, foam no. costume. However, oh, what I must no, say is fine. they're huge. <laughs> he's fine. He doesn't uh, do And them. I'm not being funny, but like, I, I'll show you the, the uh, you know, the what's supposed to be a walk-in under the stairs cupboard that I've got. That you that's, your, that's your oh, problem. Okay. Now, I... I is this the one that you fell out? Yeah, fell into into, or fell out? because all Joe's stuff is in the garage, so we can't put the boxes we've got in there into the garage. We have a double garage. I just must list. add, homes are meant to be lived in, right? You don't live at my home anymore. <laughs> homes are meant to be lived in, whether you live there you or not. You don't live at my house. Hashtag squatters' rights, and I just think that yeah, I had to store some things there for a couple of weeks. They will be sorted out this week. A couple of weeks. It's been a month. Oh, yeah. oh you've got to be kidding me! They've been there for six months. All your crap up in that the eaves. That's dramatised in the eaves. In the eaves. Crap up in the eaves. That's the name of my autobiography. Can we <laughs> say crap up in the eaves? Um, so I'm being cancelled this week in the courtroom. Yeah, I'm done. You're being cancelled because I don't know if you've got this problem. You had this problem when oh. he lived with oh, you. Oh no. This boy's poos. 
No, are this so, is not right. Are so buoyant that he they cannot go down in one flush. Oh, see, so this, instead this of doing two that. flushes, he'll just leave it for me to see. So every, I'd say, one out of two days, I'll awaken to a surprise. And it's not fun. I must say, look. Why do you not put, if you do go to the toilet, you put bleach down, then that'll help flush it away. Mum, how you keep a relationship healthy and alive is by surprising your other half. <laughs> and no day should be the same. So therefore, if I would like to leave a floating log in the toilet to surprise my other half, God. then That's I shall. disgusting. It's I would hell. be mortified if dad came into the toilet and saw that. Mum, the other day I farted into a cup and flung it at his face. Sometimes help. you just need to keep things alive. How old are you? I'm 26 and thrive. <laughs> nearly 27 nearly 27 she, that's that's not funny oh i'd hate that i can't bear that when you go in the toilet Do you know what in there it's but got guys, to the point can I say, i'm not messy i'm not i just i no, just you are very flush clean. and very i'm clean. very clean i flush why I just, don't you put a bit of toilet paper down it wouldn't put a bit of bleach it I, do flush that. It away. I, I do that and trust me it just don't work i don't mind it really but it's not ideal now i've just given up and i'll just deal with it oh. and sort it because it, 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 I mentioned it the first time, and then now it just seems to be a thing, and that's oh, fine. It's funny. <laughs> do you do no, it on purpose? Like no, I don't. No, I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. Child. How do you know when you've got piles? Oh, you know about it. You've not got piles. You're no. fine. Come Have on. You? <laughs> I've got every lotion and potion on the, on the planet for you if you've got them. On that note, <laughs> um, what a great time it's been. I say we've learned very little about Kane. Bless him, he needs to come on and do another one. We'll do a part two, Roman Reloaded the Re-Up, because... The what? Right, what, what it's you... a Nicki Minaj Sorry. song. Name five Nicki Minaj songs, go. go. No, can't do, can't do any more. Name one. What? Try one. I don't know one of them. You must know. Nicki Minaj, come on, think. I don't know, I don't think. Know. Come on, pass the liver damage and the brain... I the don't brain know, profits. I don't like her. Name what? one song. You must know one Nicki Minaj I song. Don't. Name one Rihanna song. Uh, on. Umbrella. Oh, nice. see, you're getting there. Mum used to hate Rihanna back in the day, didn't you? Why? She was she was an Ofcom. Oh my God, wait. She was an Ofcom mum. She used to hate X Factor results show on a Sunday night. Did Rihanna came on with her red hair, mum would be like, I hate Did that. Did you complain when Rihanna came on in her bikini? When it was on? Vocally, yeah, to the school playground. Anyway, just quickly, <laughs> we call Kane Ofcom Kane because oh, um, Kane complained when, you know, the Loose Women fight with Kim Woodburn and yeah. um, Colleen Nolan. You know, that was the most complained thing ever on TV. Yeah. I was my, one of them. My, Who did you My husband to be here. I, oh, sorry, Colleen. I stuck up for Kim Woodburn. Right. Because she's... <laughs> right. I did see it. But it was she like came a in. piranha no, no, show. She came in. It was like her when they were That's all... That's the thing. It was the, it was the multiple people against one. Yeah. And it was obviously something had been sprung on her. And we've seen how TV and theatre and that kind of show busy world works. They? they do it for reaction. It was a and setup. They do it for a click. It was a setup. And it was a setup. And I felt really bad for Kim because you could see her spiralling. I am team Kim always. She came on yeah. the podcast. Oh, yeah, she I've got uh, marigolds she? behind me. I'm Tim Kim. I'm Keem Tim. Keem <laughs> Keem Tim. I'm Keem Tim. <laughs> you haven't had a drink. I've said on that note Joe. about nine times trying to wrap this up. Um, We've got a dog to go home to. She's been on her own since one o'clock. We'll see you next week for a very fun roast episode. But in the meantime, <laughs> thank you, Kane, for coming with me. Goodbye. Love you all. Yes, goodbye, everybody. And we'll see you thank very you soon. For, yeah, what about subscribe, watching and all that? Yes. Um, yes. Why don't you kick that off, mum? <laughs> You'll be so loud, right? When you carry no, you can you can watch us on YouTube, can't you? Yeah, listen on Spotify and rate us on Spotify. Yeah. And also how many stars? Five stars. Yeah, on Spotify, yeah. please, and also Apple TV. Is that right? No, it's no. not. <laughs> <laughs> Apple TV. <laughs> yeah, and if you watch us on Netflix, <laughs> and if you watch us on Netflix, make sure to subscribe <laughs> on Apple TV. Hey, and if, why? Make sure to. Butler, so I'll be watching you on Apple TV. I'm not. Like, subscribe, and rate us. Thank you very much. Bye. Bye, bye, bye. everyone.